What is up you guys, it is Tony Nanloach or Nightmare here with a brand new video and today we finally got one. Yes, right in front of you, you can see the mystery power box. I've been waiting to get one of these for so long. My Walmart said that they had them but I went multiple times and they were never in stock. And I could have ordered them off the, the website but sometimes they were out of stock there and I just never got around to it. I'd always be broke whenever I wanted to do it. But I got one, and there was two there, so I'm going to try to go back and get the other one. I don't know if anyone else does stuff like this, but I actually went and I hid the other box so that I could get it because these are so rare to get. So I'm really excited. And if you don't know anything about this mystery power box, it's actually a 1 in 50 chance, I believe, to get a vintage old school pack, as you see in the top right corner. Find randomly inserted first edition packs. And they don't have to be first edition. You can also get uh, just old school packs that aren't first edition. So as you can see right there, there is the base set. They also have the fossil set. They have Team Rocket. There's a bunch of, uh, a couple packs I never even opened. Like the, what is that? The, the Phantoms one right there. I never opened that one. So there is going to be a couple packs if I do pull one that I haven't even had a chance to open yet, which is awesome. But as you can see, it comes with five packs. And uh, what's weird is the first set of these that I saw people opening, it came with five packs and then if you got a vintage pack, it included an extra pack. So you would receive six packs overall. But now there was another like shipment of them or they went and made more and I believe if you get a vintage pack, you only get five. But right here it says plus one bonus item, but I think that's just the coin that comes with it because it comes with a little coin in here. But I'm super excited. It's one out of 50 chance, so it's very slim we're gonna pull one. But if we do, I'm gonna lose my shit. And like I said, I'm going to try to get a couple more of these. I had another one at the store I wanted to go grab. And then I might even order some offline because I would like to get a vintage pack. If anybody watches this channel at all, they know that I love the old school base packs or any of the old school packs in general. Just like all of you guys, I'm sure. And also, if you see over here, we have a uh, Sun and Moon Guardians Rising pack. I have not opened any of these yet. I only got one just to kind of throw in with this video. So as you can see right there, there's some of the artworks. going to have to zoom in. Get my camera going. Get her all nice and warmed up like. You can do it, little guy. You can do it. I believe in you. I believe you can do it. Okay, maybe not. Maybe, maybe, maybe. maybe, maybe. <laughs> Anyways, you can see it there. I'm going to get some of these packs and do a proper couple opening for these in the future. So you will see that. So make sure to stay tuned. And I threw a couple dollar store packs in here. This is kind of just for shits and giggles. But as you will see in my dollar store pack opening that I just filmed recently, I've been literally waiting to upload that video for months. I've just been super lazy. So I need to get on it. But I filmed that dollar store pack video before I even saw one on YouTube. Like I didn't even know the dollar store had these packs. And then I waited so long that now I've seen multiple on there. So Kind of waited too long on that one. But anyways, we got lots of videos coming up for you guys. Mystery Power Box, Guardians Rising, Dollar Store Packs. Let me know down below if you guys have any other ideas for packs you want to see me open. And let's jump right into this. Alright, we got everything prepped and ready. And I think we're going to open the box first because I am feeling lucky. But like I said, the chances of getting one of these vintage packs are, I believe it's like 1 in 50. It's very low. So, I mean, I'm not expecting anything too crazy, but we're going to do this one pack at a time. First pack, we got an X and Y Phantom Forces, and I actually need to open more of these packs on the channel. I'm not sure how many I've done, but I do want to get the Gengars in this set and get all of the good cards in the set anyway. So, I haven't opened too many cards on this uh, channel just yet. Alright, we got an Evolutions, and that's totally fine with me as well. There was one other secret rare card I wanted to get from this set, as you can go see in the four parts that I filmed before. And as for the third pack, we got... Come on now, baby. We got, here. We got a Roaring Skies. Oh, no. And... Oh, wait, there's supposed to be five, but you can see the front one, so this is going to be the one. And... Oh, we got another Roaring Skies, but like I said, it's totally fine. I knew the chances going into this. These boxes are super, whoa, it's like in the front slit right here. Like you have to actually pull it out. What? What? Okay, there we go. Cool. So, this is a pretty, a variety of packs open for you guys, so I'm pretty stoked on that actually. So we gotta get something good, right? Out of all these freaking packs that we got, Primal Clash. Two Roaring Skies, Evolutions, Phantom Forces, 
Sun and Moon Guardians, and then we got Dollar Store Packs. So, oh yeah, and where's that coin at? Oh, we got the Rolling Sky one. Yeah, you guys see that, baby? That little shiny, shiny son of a gun. And this is for you guys. If we can get my camera to stop being an ass. There we go. Alright, so we're going to jump into the Primal Clash first. So yeah, it's been forever, man. I've literally had, like, all these cards, and I've wanted to make all these videos, but I'm just a lazy YouTuber. I suck at life. And when you're a smaller channel, I mean, I go through spurts of, like, being productive and doing a lot of videos, and then it's just, I don't know, sometimes I fall off for a while, because when you don't have, like, a big number of people that are expecting a video from you every day, you know, it's, like, a little bit harder to get pumped to do videos, but... I actually just broke 200 subscribers, and that I know that's not that many people, but for me, that's like a really huge milestone, so I've been getting 100 subscribers a year. That's not the best, you know, but I am going to work harder this summer and try to get more videos out for you guys, so hopefully uh, we can get something going. Oh, yes, dude, the first pack. We already got a full REX. Hell yeah, dude. Look at that, baby. That Agron EX. Oh, oh. Awesome, so we'll put that to the Z back. That is a good start, man. I am totally fine with that. We didn't get a old school booster, but we already have some decent cards in the mix. So, uh, and if you guys haven't yet, go check out my other playlist that I have if you're into the Pokemon openings. I've opened a lot of packs, and we are going strong. I'm going to be uploading that dollar store opening that I did. We got a Toji Chip, baby. We got an Ultra Ball Trainer, baby. We got a Cash Queen, baby. We got a Hawlucha, baby. We got a Dratini, baby. We got an EK, baby. The one who started it all. And now two, baby. We got a Shelgen, reverse. And we got a regular rare. That is isn't all right with me. Like I said, started it off good with a decent card. We're just going to keep this thing rolling. Try not to make these videos too long. But uh, yeah, down below, say which code you pulled or grabbed, even if you grabbed all three of them. Totally fine with me. But uh, if you want to go check out my social medias down below, I link them. And I actually do code giveaways on my Instagram as well as my Twitter. I'll go give away like, you know, eight, six to eight codes on a post here and there. Sometimes I'll put up a bunch of them because I have pages of codes that I haven't used. And I don't play the online game. So that's actually a pretty cool reverse token tip right there. No way, dude. We got another EX. Hell yeah, dude. This is already a really good start. And we have a bunch of packs to go. So we will set this back there. We got two EXs in three packs. That is not a bad ratio at all. Man, this pack's actually really hard to open. Which one's just evolutions? Dang, dude, they made these things invincible. Holy crap. I'm gonna have to use the knife? No way, dude. Wow. That thing is freaking crazy, man. I don't want to damage the cards, so we are gonna have to be very careful. Alright. Dude, this thing is, like, put together good. So, I don't know if you guys have... I've talked about this in other pack openings but if you see this it means that you didn't get a good pull so there's differences between the codes so like I don't know, I'm not sure if that means you got one I'll have to check some of the other ones I think that means that you got a good card and this one means that you didn't get a good card but we're about to find out and it kind of bums me out because it takes away the complete surprise of it and I didn't know that and once someone told me that it kind of ruined things for me so it's like good to know and bad to know but anyways we got Brock's grip trainer come on camera what are you doing, man? We got a maintenance trainer. We got a switch trainer. I love seeing these old school base set cards. We got an energy, a ratata, a Vulpix. We got an Electabuzz, Magikarp, a reverse Porygon, okay, yeah. and a regular Rare Mewtwo. And I would like to get the remake hollow of this card because I've pulled so many of the regular rares that they put out. So I'd like to get, I think I got the reverse too, but I'd like to get the actual hollow because I believe they redid that as well. Alright, so we're not even going to look at this. This is going to be cool because you guys get the code and I don't even have to look if we're going to get a good pull. So that kind of makes it the suspense a little bit better. Alright, we are just going to fly through this. We got Klefki, we got we got a Litwick, a Yanma, a Spiro, we got a Krabby, we got a Dino Baby, we got a Lit Leo Baby, yeah, and yeah, a Lit yeah. Baby regular rare but we are point i think that's the five packs already i think we went through those so we are going to jump into the sun and moon guardian rises rising and this is the first one that i have opened man these new ones are freaking put together good man i don't know what they're making these things out of 
but they are doing their job good. All right, let's see if we can do this without giving away the surprise. Look at this, man. These things are freaking crazy good put together. Whoa, these look cool. Aw, oh, man. I already did that and messed it up. Keep forgetting. All right, we got... Oh, yeah, and I forgot. So they have the two types over here. If you've played Sun and Moon or the new games, you would know. But it's pretty dope that they did that. We got the Graveler. We got a Trainer. We got a Glelly. We got a Jangmo. Oh, we got a Taolo. Tylo. We got a Kovanho. We got a Barbooch, we got a Fintum Reaper, we got a Cotton in Reverse, and we got a Waylord and an Energy. So that was kind of weird that they had that little extra one. So these are just random dollar store packs I threw in. I probably should have opened these first because the chances of pulling something are complete crap on these, as you guys will see. Some people get luck with it, but I don't know. My buddy Cameron, I said in the other video, he pulled a freaking Mega Charizard. So that blew my mind out of a dollar store pack. Why am I showing you guys that? There's not even anything. What am I doing with my life? This is what we got. I'm not even going to go through pretending like these are going to be anything that they're not. But we got two more. Just going to fly through this. But thank you guys for watching. I know I've been gone for a while, but expect more videos. I'm going to be doing more playthroughs. I'm going to be doing more Pokemon openings, skateboarding, music. I actually have a couple songs and covers that are coming out way soon. So super excited to show you guys those. And, uh, yeah, so that's gonna do it. We got these old school cards, and we pulled, I'm totally fine with this. We got the two EXs, the full art, and the regular one. And for coming back for the first video, this is pretty dope. Let me know down below if you guys want to see me open any more mystery power boxes. I think these are awesome. I love the nostalgia, and I love the chances of getting these old school packs. So, let me know if you guys have gotten anything cool out of these, or if you've pulled one of the old school base packs. And I will see you guys in the next one. Give this video a thumbs up, and peace. Peace.